The educational system in Prednestrovia is a symbiosis of several systems. After the Soviet Union came to an end, the educational system was updated to reflect the unique needs of the people of Prednestrovia, with a modern progressive curriculum and pedagogical standards that are on par with those in Russia and the rest of Europe. In Prednestrovia, there are currently 157 elementary schools that serve the needs of some 22,000 children. There are also 160 combined primary and upper primary schools, 16 vocational schools, and 9 institutions of higher learning. Reflecting the multi-ethnic composition of the country, educational facilities at all levels are offered in Prednestrovia's three official languages. Moldovan, Ukrainian, and Russian. The academic achievements of Prednestrovian public schools is a source of pride for the country, reflecting the quality of the education that young people receive. Every year, representatives of universities in Russia, Moldova, and Ukraine visit Prednestrovia in order to recruit local students for their universities and other institutions of higher learning. The Prednestrovia Ministry of Education works closely with the Federal Agency for the Commonwealth of Independent States in order to ensure that graduates of the Prednestrovian educational system meet or exceed international standards. This has allowed Prednestrovian students to place in Russian and other CIS nations universities for their bachelor's, master's, and doctoral degrees or to complete a medical residency. The Ministry of Education in Prednestrovia is committed to providing a modern and fully progressive system of education for the young people in this country. To this end, the Ministry has also implemented a dual track of study that offers vocational training similar to that which is available in Russia and Germany. Vocational training combines academic pursuits with hands-on experience and training, allowing students to secure good paying jobs immediately upon graduation. The jewel in the Prednestrovian educational system is the Taras Shevchenko State University in Tiraspol, the intellectual center of the republic and the alma mater of many of the country's current leaders, academics, and decision makers. Founded in 1930, the Taras Shevchenko State University originally functioned as a teacher's training college, but in 1990 it was merged with the Tiraspol State University to become a comprehensive provider of higher learning, offering a full range of multidisciplinary fields of study including science, math, and liberal arts degrees. Today, the university is the largest scientific research center in the country. The advancement of scientific knowledge plays an important role in the intellectual and economic health of the Republic. Significant developments have come out of research conducted at the university that have benefited the entire country, including improvements in machine engineering, agriculture, computer technology, medicine, and biotechnology. Scientists at the university work closely with their colleagues in Russia and around the world to ensure that they stay abreast of new developments in technology so that students are prepared for the digital economy of the 21st century and beyond. The Humanities Department of the University also plays an important role of ensuring a continuing connection with the culture, language, literature, and traditions of Russia. The University also has departments that specialize in the culture, language, and literature of Moldova, Ukraine, and Bulgaria. Sports and physical education also play an important role in the lives of young people in Prednestrovia. 28 sports schools across the Republic serve more than 13,000 students. And every year, 214 student-athletes are awarded the title of Master of Sports, while 36 student-athletes achieve the coveted title of International Master of Sports. Athletes from Prednestrovia regularly compete in regional and international competitions at the very highest level, including European and World Championships, European and World Cups, and other prestigious tournaments. But the highest achievement in sports has been the participation of Prednestrovian athletes in the Olympics. To date, local athletes have won nine Olympic medals, including five gold, one silver, and three bronze medals. Organized by the State Service for Sports, a wide variety of athletic and sporting competitions are held every year in Prednestrovia. In 2019, 24 different events have already taken place that saw more than 2,000 athletes competing for various prizes and awards. 
But it is not just organized sports which are the focus of the Predestrovian government. A healthy and active lifestyle is strongly encouraged for all members of the public, and the current president of the republic, Vadim Krasnoselsky, leads by personal example. One of the most popular athletic events in Predestrovia is the Spartakiad, a sort of group gymnastic event whose name is a portmanteau of Sparta and Olympiad. Different departments and ministries of the government send teams to the annual Spartakiad, and competition is fierce. The Spartakiad is not just about athletic competition, but it's designed as a public way to encourage a healthy and active lifestyle for people of all ages in Prydnestrovia. There is also a school Spartakiad held in every city and district of Prydnestrovia where schools at all educational levels compete with one another for medals. Training and preparation for the school Spartakiad is a crucial part of the curriculum and part of the government's ongoing drive to encourage the public at large to maintain a healthy lifestyle. As part of this commitment, the government has opened a number of sports and recreational facilities, including the opening of a new mini-football stadium in Tiraspol, the rehabilitation of two stadiums in Benderi, and several municipal swimming pools. The current administration has approved legislation to open public sports facilities in every city and district in the country, and more than 20 have been built in the last five years. The sport of football, sometimes known as soccer, is very popular in Prydnestrovia. At the Sharif Stadium in Tiraspol, a football academy was established that now instructs more than 700 young people aged 7 to 17 every year on the fundamentals of the world's most popular sport. By organizing exciting and competitive sporting competitions, placing an emphasis on physical education, and building public sports and recreational facilities, the government of Prydnestrovia has committed itself to improving the health and physical well-being of all of its citizens. <laughs>